Utah. Hello, I'm Caitlin Sass. And I'm Avery Botcher. Welcome, Welcome back, back to Teen, teen Talk. Talk. On this episode of Teen Talk, we're talking about stress with teens. So we sat down with some students and asked them what stresses them out. I think just trying to find the time to do everything that I'm in, uh, especially with extracurriculars and sports and uh, homework. Uh, being in honors classes, you know, there's extra homework that you have to do. So kind of just finding the time to manage all of those things at once. I mean, I'm pretty busy in one day. <laughs> right now, a lot is um, just trying to figure out college and figure out how to pay for college and finishing up the school year. And I'm ready to be done with school, but high school is still stressful. Um, well, homework, tests. Keeping, all, keeping your grades up when you have to manage like sports and all your responsibilities at home? Um, typically schoolwork. Uh, now that I'm 16, the job has come into play, so that's pretty stressful already. Uh, managing my duties as a student with being an athlete and actually trying to make money and working is probably the most stressful part right now. We would also like to know, what different types of stress do you deal with? Um, well, as far as the good stress goes, I would have to say uh, anything that, you know, my extracurriculars, you know, I joined them obviously because I love doing them. Uh, even though it's work, it's good work and I like doing it, so uh, it gives you a goal to strive for, like learning a new song or something. You really like the song, even though it's really hard, you know, you got to get it down, you got to learn it. So. And as far as bad stress, obviously, just stuff that you don't want to do, like homework that for a class that you don't necessarily like or aren't very good at, so it's kind of tough to do that. School is really stressful for me, so that's my main stressor. Um, I used to have cheerleading, but since that's over now, that's a lot. That's been relieved, and so um, family doesn't really stress me out. So basically just school, I think. And my homework, yeah. Homework is a lot. It's really stressful. I'm trying to get it done. I have a lot of classes, so. Mainly like academic stress, keeping, like, staying focused at school, keeping your grades up, and then having to deal with sports and stuff like that. Stress, there's, you know, usually positive stress. Parents telling you to uh, do your homework, you know, make sure you ace this quiz, study for a test, just things like that. In relation to that, how do you deal with those types of stress? Um, I do a lot of listening to music uh, when I'm doing my homework or when I'm just like sitting at home and I'm not doing anything for once I have a break I'll just turn on some music and maybe close my eyes or just hang out with some friends or take a drive or something like that. I do with my stress by trying to plan everything out because I feel better when I have a plan to execute and get rid of my stress so I try to get rid of it piece by piece and then once the list keeps getting shorter and shorter that's when I start to feel better. Time management is big help like I just set aside time to get everything done usually through physical activity uh, I play a lot of sports so that kind of helps quite a bit uh, if I'm in the off season either working out you know listening to music helps a lot too so lastly what types of good stress do you deal with and go through Um, I would definitely say, like I said before, music, um, just because, I mean, obviously it's one thing to have a stress of like one song, but because I'm in like three different choirs, it's kind of like, it, it becomes very overcumbersome sometimes. Uh, and I would have to say that the good stress, I mean, obviously I love all of those things, which is why I'm in all of them. And so even though it's a lot, it's good. And I'm like excited for every moment that I get with it. I think school is a good stress. So even though it's my main stressor, it's a good stress because it's not bad for me and trying to better myself and college is stressful but that's also good because I obviously want to go to college and I need to stress a little bit about it so I can make the best decision for myself. Like pressure to be better than what you can be, like positive pressure basically. Uh, like I said earlier, the uh, positive stress would be the parents most of the time. Uh, the brother really isn't a big factor in that. Uh, it's just a push by the parents, a typical push to uh, do well in school, you know, succeed. So, yeah. Wow, you really don't know how much stress people go through. They sure are busy people. 
I could definitely rate, relate to everyone when I say I don't get stressed out once in a while with the musical, choir, school, and sports, but that's just a part of life. You just have to go through it. Well, speaking of life and going through it, did you know that 77% of people in the world go through a regular basis of stress on their daily lives? No, I, I didn't know that. But did you know that Chicago is in the top three cities with the people who have the most stress, along with New York City and Los Angeles? I can definitely see that, especially with the economy and job opportunities here. It absolutely should be in the top three cities of a stressful population. Well, that wraps it up for Teen Talk today. Anything else you want to add? Nope. <laughs> well, okay. Thanks for tuning in to Teen Talk. Teen Talk, Teen Talk, talking with teens and the teens are talking. Teen Talk. I'm Avery Botcher. And I'm Caitlin Sass. See you next time.